you're coming here to check out my review of the Campbell Posture Cane. But you know what? I'm going to throw this into a double review because we're also going to look at the Gopher Pro. It's, it's the next line of grabbers. But first, this is Jeff with Jeff Reviews for You. And my channel is dedicated to reviewing as seen on TV items, consumer gadgets, other household goods. Once in a while, I throw in a little DIY just for fun. If you like that, please consider subscribing to my channel by hitting that button below and clicking the bell so you're notified every time I release a video just like this one. Now, let's get to today's review. The evolution of grabbers over the years hasn't really changed. So this part of the review is going to be kind of short. So what I did is I, I took the Gopher Pro out of its packaging. There's only two zip ties holding it in. I actually already had the Gopher 2, which is the previous model. And that's what this looks like, okay? So the Gopher Pro is yellow. See the yellow? And the Gopher 2 was blue. Um, they look relatively the same, except if you see by the hinge, the Gopher Pro has a much beefier hinge here, and this was always a point of weakness um, for these grabbers. So what you do, it's pretty simple. Well, first I have to make sure my rubber bands are off. I think they are off. Yep, there we go. Is you open it on up and snap it into position. You don't really hear anything, but you just know that it, it won't move back and forth. It's about three feet long. Um, it does have these suction cups here on the end, which is great for grabbing things. If you've never used one of these, you can also pull this part back and turn it so now the grabber part goes the opposite direction. Um, I actually like the upgrade here because as I said before, I often break my grabbers right here in this exact spot. Um, but these things are good for people needing to grab stuff off the floor or reach up in high places. Um, so that's the Gopher Pro. I should say that it does have a lock feature here. So if you have to lock it, um, lock it in place or not, it does allow you to lock it in place. That's pretty cool, right? Um, so that's the Gopher Pro. Now let's get over to Campbell's Posture Cane and see how that works out. Before I continue on, I want to get your opinion. What do you think about the double reviews doing two items in one video? Leave a comment in the comment section below. Now, let's continue on. So now we're going to take a look at the Campbell Posture Cane. Um, before I, I take this out, I'm going to give you a bit of a backstory. So about 15 years ago, I was involved in a car accident where I actually broke my back. So from time to time, um, I have some back pains where sometimes it's hard to stand or go do things. Mostly it's, it's after I go over exert myself and do things that I definitely should not be doing. Um, so I'm going to be utilizing this cane over the next week because this past um, few days I ended up throwing my back out again so it's been pretty sore. So I'm excited to try this out um, because I like the idea of the posture standing up and maybe even the support walking. Let's do a quick unboxing first just to see what it looks like, okay? So it's in a nice packaging here. It looks like it's in pieces, so I'm gonna end up having to, I'm gonna end up having to put it together. Sorry about that. Let's snap the rest of these off. Alright, so this one right here has looks like the string or the rubber elastic there, and that'll come down. It does have a tensioning um, spot here so I can tighten it down. I do like the end here, how it looks like this will be a pretty solid um, base to stand on. And then I, I'm guessing that the posture part will, will somehow screw in the top here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this together and then I'm going to go test it out. Over the next week or so, I'm actually going to utilize this um, just to see how I feel it works for me uh, with my height, uh, with my weight, all those kind of things. And really if I feel that if it supports me. Um, so this is the first look at the Campbell Posture Cane. Um, it looks like a good size, and I do see some a, a button here on the side that I can make it go taller or shorter. Um, well, it's not really moving yet. Let's see. Nope. Let's see if I have to keep tightening this. Well, I'll have to figure that out because it's not, it's not moving like it's supposed to. So we will see. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. So I gotta go down and not up. So there we go. So it does get taller and I like that so I can adjust that to myself. All right, so I'm gonna test this out and I'll let you know how, how it works. I wanted to show you a pretty cool feature 
um, with the posture can. As I was reading the directions, it actually says it can stand up all by itself. So if you're walking and you're using this as like a hiking tool or just a walking tool, you can set it down and just leave it there. It's pretty cool. Stands up all by itself. So it's always ready for you just to grab it and go. I just wanted to show you that. So I've spent the last week utilizing the Campbell Posture Cane. And now I'm going to tell you about a little bit of my thoughts from the week. Um, I really like this heavy duty rubber base where I can just set it on the ground and it stands by itself. And you know what? When I was using it, I felt as though it was going to support me. And I really, really liked that. I liked how this can extend. It starts at about, um, it's just about three feet if I leave it at the smallest setting. And it goes up about 10 more inches or so um, on one inch increments. So just so you know that it goes up about three foot, 10 inches um, from, from three feet. I'm six foot four and it was perfect for me at the height. I did do it at the tallest height, however. Um, so just so you know that I like walking with it. I felt as though I could go hiking with it. It's definitely um, a stable cane to use. And I think it does just what it intends to do. It helps with posture. So if you're seated and maybe you're hunched over, this thing will definitely help you stand up and push up like that. Um, I will say it's not a typical cane. So if you're thinking you're going to buy a typical cane for this sells for about $29.99, um, the handle is definitely different. It's not tilted to give you that support like that. This is definitely for standing and walking like this. So if you're looking for a typical cane, I wouldn't necessarily go um, with this one. But if you want the posture cane and you like the way that this could be used as a walking stick, I think you're good to go. I didn't mention before, but it does have this cool lanyard um, here that you can hold on to. It does have a little clip that it pops off. But that was the posture cane. So in this double review, I did the Gopher Pro, which sells for about $12.88 at Walmart. And you know what? It's a great little grabber. So if you're looking for a grabber, I'd say go for it and get it. 13 bucks, you can't beat it. I do like that added new feature where the hinge um, had the little thicker plastic piece so it won't break due to the weight or whatnot. And I also did the Campbell Posture Cane. Um, this one, like I said, is about $29.99 at Walmart. That's my reviews of these. This was Jeff with Jeff Reviews for You. As always, I appreciate you stopping by. Have a great day. Hey, since you're still here, why don't you go check out my video of the perfect egg maker? Do you remember this? I did this not too long ago. I'm going to link it right up here above my head. Now, if you're watching this video and you're not logged into your YouTube account, you're not going to see anything pop up here and you're going to think I'm crazy. So make sure you log in. That way you can see the link right here to the perfect egg maker. You know what? I'll see you at that review right here.